guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I am showing you part two of my makeup collection. So just the other side of my Alex drawers and what's on top of my desk. So I hope you like it and enjoy. Okay, so now for the other side of my Alex drawers table. So I've got these style lashes. I have these big fluffier ones and then that go from thicker to thinner, which is really, really pretty. So we'll start here. My favorite is the Soft Ochre Paint Pot. I've got the MAC pigments in tan and naked, which I haven't actually used these a lot. I've got the, the Balm Shady Lady eyeshadow. The Glitter Glue by Too Faced, my favourite, makes all, um, all eyeshadows just pop. And then the Shadow Insurance, just a mini one. Then here are all my single eyeshadows and Colourpop eyeshadows. So I've got the Napoleon Colour Disc in 33. The Benefit eyeshadows, these are really old, in shallow. The one in Getaway. The, the NYX Prismatic Eyeshadows in Golden Peach. Very pretty. And another one in Liquid Gold. Then I've got the MAC Eyeshadow in Cranberry. And then a Astralis Metalix, which is just the gold pretty one. So this is just where I keep all of my lashes. So I keep it there so I can use them again on myself. And so now my ColourPop shadows. This uh, is Cornelius, which I don't know whether or not it's available anymore. I've got ooh, Fringe, Fairfax, Girly, Un, Un, I think, Un Blaze, Partridge, Another partridge, I got two of them, and then the Get Lucky. Okay, next drawer. So these are pretty much all for eyes and then lips. It's just this, oh, and these two here are just lips. So in this one, I have, oh, so in this one, I have some brow pencils, Anastasia, and ColourPop. Got the Australis Tint My Brow, and then this is the Anastasia Clear Brow Gel, which it's rubbed off. Then I have some lash glue, the Ardell Lash one, the non-latex and the latex, and the pencil sharpener. In this one, I've got um, eyeliners, so the Marc Jacobs Steeler Sail Day Waterproof Liquid Eyeliner. The Too Faced Sketch Markers, a black and a brown one, Colourpop Gel Liners, some more gel liners, the Too Faced Perfect Eyes, and the Kat Von D Tattooed Liner. Then for lip liners, I have the Colourpop Lippy Pencil, the MAC in Subculture, the Kylie Dolce K, the MAC in Spice, the Candy K, and then Boldly Bear. So up the top here I have some deep brows. I have the medium brown, soft brown, and soft brown, and dark brown. I have the NYX Eyebrow Cake Powder, and then this is just an Essence eyebrow powder, powder that is really really pretty. I have the Tartiest Clay Paint Liner which is really good. The Colourpop Gel 
liners of this one is a pretty much like a pomade eye pomade the dot dope top a swerve which is the black eyeliner and then dirty talk which is a gold one here are my mascaras so I've got one by Terry roller lash Urban Decay Perversion, They Are Real by Benefit, Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara, and then the Waterproof Version. So this is just my lip stuff. So this... So this is a Frank Body Lip Scrub, which I like to use if I have dry lips. The Burt's Bees Tinted Lip Balm, Mario Badescu Lip Wax, the Lip Injection by Too Faced, and the MAC Prime. So these are all pretty much all my liquid lipsticks and my other lipsticks here that I didn't want to put up on the top of my thing. Okay, so these are all the Colourpop lippies. These are the matte lips. I'm not going to go through them all. It'll take too long. And then these are all the satin ones. So I've got some Kylie Cosmetics. I've got the Candy K and Dolce K in the liquid lipsticks and then the So Cute and Like lip glosses. Then I have the Minis. Um, I think these were her birthday collection. So Coco K, Dolce K, Exposed, Candy K and Leo. Then I have the Mini Stila liquid lips. So this one's Kristen, Como, Patina, Aria, and Chianti. I, I'm butchering them names, but okay. The Anastasia Liquid Lip in Milkshake, which is a really, really light one. The Caramello Big Liquid Lipstick, which is a nearly melted sugar longwear melted lipsticks by Too Faced. And this one is Melted Chihuahua. And then this is just a mini of the Caramello, which is pretty much out. So up the back here, if you can get them out. So here are just pretty much like my drugstore lipsticks that I don't really reach for. These are two Velour lips from Australis. A Chi Red Lipstick. A... Maybelline Whisper lipstick, some NYX, so these are all NYX, and these are some more Maybelline lipsticks here, a hair oil, and then the Gerard Cosmetics lipsticks, which are really, really drying. And in here, this is a Kat Von D in Noble, so that's a... And a Jeffree Star liquid lipstick in 714 which I don't really like it's very patchy and I don't know it's it's just not for me but these are just pretty much like my drugstore makeup that I have which I've just put in here because I don't like getting rid of makeup I'm more I'm like a makeup hoarder but I don't know they're just mm, sentimental values so we have some of the shop and say brushes NYX Blush, Natio, Australis, and Maybelline. And then up here, we've got the NYX Bronzer, Face of Australia, Loose Powder, an Elf Powder, um, Catalina G.O., which is the brand I use when I've done my makeup course, the NYX Mineral, uh, the Seven CC Powder, and banana and then the last straw is just got like my brush cases and my GHD box and just bits and pieces okay so these are just some of my favorite foundations my MAC lipsticks one is missing and my fix pluses so my fix pluses that I have is the MAC Fix Plus in rows, the scented ones, and then just the normal Fix Plus. Then I have my favourite foundations of all time that I use mostly every client, and these are the Cover FX Custom Cover Drops. I use these just by themselves, um, and it just gives the most flawless full coverage look. 
you have ever seen. And then at the back here I have the Makeup Forever Ultra HD Foundation in 125 and then three Stila Stay All Day foundations. So I have Fair, Honey and Medium. So now over here are my lipsticks. So this one is uh, one that I got from Mecca at an opening giveaway. This one is just a red. It's got a little bit of a divot out of it, but they're pretty red. Then I have these two Marc Jacob lipsticks. They are both the same color in Kiss Kiss Bang Bang. Just little mini lipsticks and that's the color there. And I have two of them. This is Viva Glam. And Snob, which is just like a pink. Um, Honey Love, which is my favorite favorite color of all time. It's my favorite. I have the Velvet Teddy, that cult favorite. The Pure Zen Cream Sheen. The Matte in Stone, which I have used but doesn't really suit me. I don't know, I think maybe because of the small, my small lips, it just, I just don't think it suits me. Matte, they're kind of sexy. And the last one I have here is the Ravishing, which is just that one there. And I've also got Blankety, but I don't know where I've put it at the moment. So over here, these are my brushes that I grab most of the time. So these are um, my, these are the Morphe, I think, 30 piece set. It's really, really good and handy. So now this one that I have displayed as well is the, the Zoeva. I think it was a 15 piece. I don't have all the brushes in here at the moment. But these are just some of the brushes. Really pretty, really good. Though I've had trouble with shedding on the big face brushes. I don't know why and it's, it's horrible but the little blending brushes and stuff, they are really, really good. And I love this one to do my eyebrows with. It's the best. Then I have my Sigma Premium Professional Kit. So I've just got, there's the face brushes, some shader brushes, underneath shader brushes, eyeliner brush. And then on the other side, my favorite concealer brush, a E25, I think. Um, what's this, an E35. And an E45. These are the ones here. So I like to keep them in the case because I just think it just looks so good and I paid a lot of money for this so I wanted to show it off. So now these are all of my individual brushes. I have some Morphe, some eBay brands, <clears throat> some single of the Sigma, I've got some Napoleon, Elf, anything you can think of, Real Techniques, anything you can think of, I pretty much got it in a brush. And then these are just my big face brushes. So I've got some, obviously, Morphe, and then the Sigma Kabuki brush, brush set. I think it was like a five piece or something. Yeah, five piece and then just some brushes from eBay. A Real Techniques brush. And yeah, these are all my face brushes. So these little stuff down here, these are just the things that I need to grab. So tweezers, eyelash curler, this needs to be chucked out. But this is the best glue. I have ever used the Lavi Brush-On Lash Adhesive. Cannot get it anymore on my Sephora. 
some scissors, always need, always need scissors to cut eyelashes and some tweezers, some pointy cotton tips and always need this is the hand sanitizer for my clients. So please remember to subscribe to my channel if you like my videos and also click the little bell next to the subscribe button to get notifications when I upload next. Thank you and see you later.